my name is Ted O'Connor. I'm the CEO of Plateau Uranium. Uh, we have large uranium resources in Peru, and uh, we put out a preliminary economic assessment last year uh, that suggests we can produce uranium for less than $17.50 a pound, which is uh, world class, and uh, it's only bettered by the best of the best Kazakh uranium operations. So uh, we're definitely in the lowest quartile. A lot of people talk about grade, and we are low grade by world standards. Um, our average grade is about 300 parts per million U308, but uh, when in the real world it boils down to economics, and uh, our, our, our economic assessments tell us that uh, we are lowest quartile production costs uh, relative to the rest of the world, and uh, and we we believe that uh, through the work we're doing that uh, we can ideally be in production uh, by 2020. Well, I, I'd say it comes down to geology. Our, our uranium deposits are unique around the world. Um, they also contain appreciable amounts of lithium. Um, so we have the lightest and the heaviest naturally occurring elements in the same rocks. Um, they were formed under uh, uh, unique conditions. The, the rocks themselves are uh, only seven million years old and they're volcanic uh, rhyolite rocks that are enriched in things like uh, potassium, lithium, aluminum, silicon, and of course uranium. Uh, the uranium was formed, it's all less than one million years old. It's, uh, it's formed under the same climatic conditions we're under now, melting glacial waters, uh, moving the uranium around and putting it where it is. It didn't move any of the lithium, but uh, uh, the uranium is, is, is there. It didn't take much energy, so uh, it doesn't take much to get the uranium back out of these rocks. Um, so they, they're, they're volcanic hosted, but they have uh, uh, some similarities to sedimentary uranium deposits, sandstone in particular, as well as some superficial uh, uranium deposits. Well, we, we just really started looking in detail at, uh, at, at how we can get the lithium out of these rocks. Um, so we, we've looked at our, our, our deposits, our uranium deposits, and, um, and, and are studying how to get the lithium out. And what we've been finding, and this is, we'll, we'll be putting out these results in the next uh, uh, month or so, the initial ones. Um, what we're finding is really encouraging. We can uh, extract about 70% of the lithium uh, alongside 90% of the uranium uh, with just plain sulfuric acid at really uh, moderate temperatures and low acid consumption uh, all around so we think the lithium story will add tremendous value to an already great uranium project. Mm -hmm.